Hey Scorpio, let's do your reading. You feel like you're on an island by yourself. You're going to be coming out of this though. Um, a lot of sadness. Needing to learn how to go with the flow a little bit more. Dolphins are going to be significant for you. Elephants as well. You're getting a lot of information. You're getting a lot of guidance, especially at night from the moon, tapping into your feminine energy. You're not listening to it. Um, I have one ring circus. Feeling like you're all alone, not moving forward. This sad embrace. And then right away, this popped in like sideways. These are just timing for me. You have this fear and it keeps playing out. Okay, once if we have a belief, that's what's going to keep manifesting for us. You have a belief that like things, things are going to go fine, like three steps forward, five steps back that you're gonna keep having tower moments. The things are always gonna be chaotic. You have to get rid of that. That's a limiting belief. All right, fours are gonna be significant. Fives are gonna be significant. A lot of changes you need to make and a lot of changes that are gonna be happening for you. You may be experiencing tower moments so that you can let go of what you need to let go of. Nines are also gonna be significant for you. Our romantic feelings. Your feelings are real and worth exploring. I feel like around the holidays, closer to December, you're going to be meeting someone new. Or this is someone that you know, but like those feelings are going to develop. So stay op optimistic about your love life. Um, the color is blue and as well as turquoise are going to be significant. Positive thinking and faith will bring you romance. If you're invited to go on a trip, I don't know why I'm seeing wineries. Um, if you're invited to go on a trip, let's just say if you're invited to do anything, just keep saying yes, yes, yes. going to put you in alignment with either the person or with the the person who's going to introduce you to this person and I have the fool I love this this is the first card of the tarot okay this is a brand new start moving forward into a new timeline with little to no baggage the hard times behind you also like, like this adventure, if you're invited on an adventure, go. And like, stay open-minded. I feel like this person that's coming in is very different from your normal type. You're highly intuitive, but you're not listening. You're allowing, I'll show you. I have High Priestess in reverse, and then this Nine of Swords, okay? Like needing to listen to your intuition and stay out of your head. These are all limiting beliefs. These are all like negative thoughts. You're being led in a direction with this wheel of fortune. If you would just listen to your intuition. Again, a lot of changes that are going to be occurring for you, especially within the next couple of months. Could be some type of court case, some type of decision being made in your favor. I have justice here. You could be in law enforcement. This person could also be in law enforcement. Needing to really stay balanced. And okay, um, Bashar says the saying, circumstances don't matter, only state of being matters. Five of wands, stop allowing the belief that chaos is going to follow you or these storms are going to follow you consistently. Um, I have temperance, but she popped in a reverse. Needing to temper your own energy, get grounded, get stable. I have on YouTube a video. It's energy clearing, cord cutting, grounding. Go and do that. It's like six or seven minutes. You have something coming in though towards your favor. 
could be a job, could be money. Could also be um, a settlement that you're going to use towards a home. It could be an approval for a home. It could be in some type of legal battle about a home. But you have this person coming in. Um, they could be a cancer. They could have cancer placements. You could also have cancer placements. You have to look at all placements. Like wanting to build, this is the four of wands, wanting to build something very stable with you. Long-term commitment, marriage, whatever that long-term commitment means to you. All, oh, I have the chills, which is confirmation. Also a sense of belonging, especially within your community. You could be moving. For some of you, when you're moving, you're going to be moving into a place where it's going to feel much more like home. You may have been feeling out of place with this one ring circus. You're going to have a deeper sense of community. You're, going to, you're also going to have a lot of support from this person as well as their friends or their family, their community. You have to stop focusing on the negative. You need to stay focused on what is coming, what it is that you want instead of what you don't want. You have a habit of focusing on this, the negative. That's not helping you. Uh, I'm trying to find out about money here. What's with what justice? Eagles may be significant, but I'm seeing like soaring high. You're going to be soaring high. On justice, I have three of cups. Okay, so a lot of celebration about whatever this decision is that's coming to you. Ones, elevens are going to be significant. You're not going to be waiting long for this decision to be made in your favor. I have the world closing out a cycle. You have a shit ton of money coming in. This coupled with the world. Like... Absolute financial stability, security, a lot of wealth here. You're definitely going to be celebrating around the holidays. New Year's is going to be an even like bigger event than it normally is for you. You may not really celebrate New Year's. And this year you're going to have a lot to celebrate. Let's see what else do we need to know. Okay, in the past, you tended to get depressed and slip into complacency. You've had to, uh, that's in reverse though. Reversals are timing for me. So you're moving out of that. This has been like a, a journey for you, self-discovery. You've had to forgive a lot of people, especially from your childhood. People that have passed as well. I have the chills confirmation. The purple is um, third eye. Like people that you have a psychic connection with, I feel like for some of those, they're pa they've already passed over. You still have this psychic connection with them. You've had to like forgive these people for harming you. Others of you, this is just like past people that you do have this telepathic communication with. You're highly intuitive. Okay, you're just not listening to it as well as you could be. Um, mysticism. So in this card, this is about someone mysterious is coming to like dinner, coming to your home. I feel like this is this person, this new romantic partner or this romantic partner. This person could be an Aquarius. Also be a fire sign. Um, this person sees you as the star. They've gone through it as well. They've gone through their own heartbreak, their soulmate energy. Okay. They've had to heal their own heart. Um, I have the star as well as the knight of wands. Okay. Person is very passionate. Um, I am getting Aquarian energy. So the, this person may have Aquarius in their chart or just have these attributes. Um, Yes, spiritual, but not in a woo-woo sense. 
they do have a lot of faith in like a higher power. Um, your, your morals and your values are going to be very similar here. The things that excite you also excite this person. Um, this person is like highly intellectual. They could be into computers, AI, technology. Almost like an introverted extrovert or extroverted introvert. Like at times this person could be very outgoing, but, but you know, at first glance, they're an introvert. They also have like this cute, goofy, but in a cute way, uh, personality. You're going to connect to this very well, though. It's really beautiful. They definitely will see you like as the center of their universe, the center of their world. Um, this person is going to really value you guardian you and your loved ones are safe and spiritually protected i told you you have a lot of protection like there's no need for you to be worried you're going through this transformation this is coming out a lot um could be dealing with the libra because they also got the transformation butterflies are going to be significant for you you are experiencing enormous change right now which brings great great blessings all right i love you guys you know what to do you got this enjoy